To other news, a Gage County deputy saved the life of a dog last night. And the whole thing was caught on video, and today we were there as the deputy reunited with the pup. Channel 8's Mackenzie Johnson has a story you'll only see here on 8, uh, and the amazing body cam footage. Mackenzie? Deputy Tom Smith made a new friend last night when he saved Wally, the dog's life. The dog had fallen through the ice in a frozen pond. Smith says he knew he had to do something. Come on. There you go. Come on, buddy. Come on. Deputy Tom Smith says he got a call around 6 p.m. last night. Someone's pet had fallen through the ice in a pond by their home near Pickerel, just north of Beatrice. As time went on, you can hear the dog's bark changing, and you could hear it start to yelp and then whine, and then it's like, time's running out. Like, we need, we need to do something. So that, that's when the time was like, all right, we, can, we need to figure out how to get me in there. In his body cam footage, you can see and hear Smith trying to coax the dog out of the pond as he tries to figure out what to do next. Come on! I know, come on, come on! I looked at the tools we had. We had a set of waders and a hammer and a rope, and I was like, well, this will be a little work to get there, but we'll get there, and that's what the dog needed. In his coworker's body cam footage, you can see Smith using a hammer in his bare hands to break the ice. Smith says he was working against the clock. That was, that was scary because the last bit of ice that I broke, the dog actually kind of fell back and then went under the water. So I had to reach under and like grab him by the scruff of the neck. So I was scared there. Luckily, Smith was able to help the dog back to shore and reunite him with his family. The dog, named Wally, is doing much better. We were able to witness Smith and Wally's reunion the day after the scary incident. Smith says he was happy to see the dog recovering. So like I knew the dog meant something to someone. So I mean, I could only imagine myself in that position and wanting my dog saved and whoever it is, someone help and I'm glad I got to be that guy. He says he wasn't really planning on jumping into freezing cold water, but situations like these are why he wanted to become a deputy. At the end of the day, I'm human. I take this vest off and you would never know I was a cop. I, I wanna make that very clear that you need help, don't ever be afraid to turn to us. I mean, granted I didn't have all the equipment, but neither did the next guy. So at that point, it's let's work together. So I, I want to put the human to the badge more than the badge standing over the human. Absolutely incredible to watch that footage and a very happy ending to the story with Wally warm and dry hmm. and Smith with a brand new furry friend. Oh, Deputy Smith, I'll tell you what, it mm -hmm. takes a lot to do that kind of stuff and yeah. I know the dog's uh, owners are very, very grateful. Absolutely. Great story. Thank you, Mackenzie.